Morning. All dressed up. I'm going to the office today. I'm gonna be a real person. <laughs> Knee deep in making beef bison pufflo. Yum. Now, yesterday I shoveled sand for a good portion of the afternoon. <laughs> so today I thought I'll go to the office instead of shoveling. Now it's time to sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I, I really enjoy the um, physical labor at the farm. It's uh, it's kind of rejuvenating. We are clearing a wooded area from all the fallen logs and trees, and the, the sticker vines are the worst thing. Um, but we also had to add sand to the pony paddocks because they, when it rains a lot, they're a little bit underwater. So... Uh, couldn't get the machinery in there to spread it, so they dumped it over the fence, and then Hugh and I sat, stood there with shovels and rakes and spread it around. So, anyway, um, so uh, I was uh, approached this past week by a group that I like um, that does uh, has a magazine that I've written for quite a bit and uh, does... A lot of different platforms for horses and um, small animals and uh, they're consolidating everything onto one platform and so they're looking for people to teach courses uh, they'll be paid courses um, but they're actually trying to get it approved as a college so that you could actually get a certificate uh, for taking courses so um, they contacted me and said, well, what content do you have that might be useful? So in my spare time in the next few days, I, <laughs> I'm going to look through some of my content and see what topics and things I think snowing in Utah 30 yesterday, but 60 today. Yeah, well, that's kind of how it goes here too. Um, see what kind of content I have and what things have been popular in the past. Uh, certainly they want me to just teach nutrition. A couple years ago I mentioned a certification in nutrition. Yeah, that would still be awesome. Yeah, and I think this platform might be the way to do that. I, that's, we're working our way up to that. We started with the uh, Homemade Food 101, which is uh, hopefully going to be uh, released in the next few weeks. We're, we're in editing stages, so uh, that was kind of the beginning point and we were going to build upwards from there. But this might be a, a good platform for us to use for that certification course because you actually will get a certification from a group that's approved as a college versus, hey, Dr. Judy Morgan says you're awesome at this. <laughs> so, uh, and maybe that's enough. Maybe that's all you guys need. But, um, you know, I... I, I would like it to have enough validity that it's worth your time and energy to uh, really put the work in. Uh, my, my dream has been that we could have, uh, for instance, pet store owners or, um, you know, people who are pet trainers, groomers, people who are really active in the pet space who want to have that extra level and be able to recommend uh, nutrition from the standpoint of the health of the animal, the personality of the animal, we can help with behavior problems, we can help with, you know, that dry, itchy skin, and just so many things. So, uh, yeah, so, yeah, and we would do it from a TCVM perspective, Sweta. Um, so, yes, uh, our home made food 101 doesn't talk about TCVM at all. It is really just from the perspective of, hey, I'm interested in 
making food for my dog, but I'm scared to death. I'm going to screw it up. How do I not screw it up? So that's where that course is coming from. It, it's because we've had that request from so many people who really want to make the leap, but they're just, they're just afraid to jump off the cliff. So <laughs> we're trying to, trying to help them realize that it is doable and, um, Itu? That's about it. Uh, Voes lo biblioteca. And that's, you know, high school Spanish. It's pronounced completely wrong. And yeah, that's what, that's what I got. So I can count to 10, I think, uh, on a good day. Uh, so Gwen is pretty good at Spanish, but I don't know if she's good enough to translate things. Certainly if somebody wants to translate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is uh, the company that we're uh, looking at working alongside. Um, they're worldwide, so uh, I think they are looking to get it um, into multiple languages. Actually, I have in my notes that they're looking to do multilingual, so that would be really good. I think French and Spanish um, are pretty popular. I, it's uh, it's fun when I talk to people from uh, Canada, and you know everything's coming in French, but I know nothing in French. So uh, okay. All right, so that's all I got for today. Uh, no, nobody overloaded my inbox with things that went wrong this week, so I got to take a step off the soapbox. Whew. You know, once in, a, once in a while, I got to get off the soapbox. All right, so everybody have a great day. You can uh, either send me emails or post on here things that you would... Um, your course is the only reason I wish to travel from Hong Kong to USA. Hey, it's all online. You don't even have to travel. I mean, you can if you want, but... Okay, everybody have a wonderful, uh, where will the Homemade 101 be available? Oh, if you're on our email list, you're going to get an email. I'm here. Um, awesome man. I did a, uh, a um, consultation with him for his dog, and he said, hey, I'm really good at loading things on YouTube and putting search keywords and all that kind of stuff, and I'd love to do it for you. <clears throat> we hired him on because uh, we needed somebody to do that. So he's doing a great job for those of you who uh, like to use YouTube. Um, the videos are, for the past year, are getting uh, put back on there. I've gotten emails from people who have left Facebook and said, yay, you're back on YouTube. Uh, the biggest problem is I don't have time to answer questions on YouTube. So now there's going to be all these questions. I looked yesterday and it's like, oh my gosh, the questions are, you know, pouring in like they usually do. And <sighs> I need somebody just to answer questions on social media. So, okay. Ruth Ackerman, I'm gonna have to hire you. <laughs> all right. Everybody have a wonderful day. And, um, it's only Wednesday, so I guess we'll see you tomorrow. That's what we do. Oops. Ugh. Talk about kidney disease soon. I've talked about that a lot. And there's a bunch of information on kidney disease. Go to the website and uh, look at the blogs. I've got a lot of blogs on kidney disease. DrJudyMorgan.com Amy Hollebeck is fluent in Spanish? Didn't know that. Contact her. Foods for kidney failure. They're in the book. An assistant. Yeah, we need bunches. That's where we are right now. We're going to need somebody soon for order fulfillment, too. Because Gwen and Brandon are kind of up to their eyeballs. <laughs> That's why we're going to the office to help today. All right, everybody have a great day.